today I'll be showing you guys how I created this digital journal page. So I like to use the graph template on Notability because I like to use the lines as a reference. And the first thing that I do is to create a title. So as you can see here, I'm doing some bubble fonts, which is my favorite type of typography to do. Afterwards, I add in the images I want to journal about. And then I take some time to just rearrange the photos to the way that I want it. I like to take my time with this because I use the photos as kind of like a reference to where my text will be. Then I like to go use the stickers that Notability has. There's new sticker packs that were released by our ambassadors and I just place them around the photos and it makes it so adorable. Next, I like to go in with some of my smaller text like the subtitles. So as you can see, I am writing the location of this bookstore that I went to in Paris and I like to trace around some of the pictures and outline just so I can make it more doodly. Sometimes I like to draw on top of the photo too. For text, I feel like it gives it a fun three-dimensional type of look. So I'm doing a script kind of font for this one. And my favorite tip to make a digital journal look very fun and cute is to layer a lot of things. So Notably has this new feature where you can layer photos, which makes it so much easier to digitally journal. I also like to use stickers like this where I can have like a little like memo or something that I want to clearly emphasize or remember. So after I finish doodling, I just start writing all the things that I did today or everything that I want to remember. I also love to journal digitally because even if I make a mistake, I can just fix this so easily so here i mean the color blue first but i want to change it to purple and it was so easy to just change it without having to use like white out or erase anything i really love to add different types of typography and fonts for the subtitles and then i just continue writing based off of what that subtitle is about so that is how i created this digital journal page i hope you guys found this helpful and let me know if you guys try it out too